Hey guys, today I'll be reviewing another Mac App Store free app, which is called Mixtap. So what Mixtap is, it's a platform where there's a lot of RSS articles arranged into categories, also known as tabs, where you can subscribe to them and then they add it on your homepage. And when you open a Mixtap, you can just click on the tab to view the articles. So let me show you what I mean. So when you first open up Mixtap, you have to sign up. You just need to simply type in your email and password. And if you already have an account, you just sign in. So here is my homepage, and obviously I've subscribed to CNN News, NBA News, and also Tech Gadgets. And if you want to subscribe to more articles, you can go to Tab Gallery. So when you get into Tab Gallery, you can find your uh, tab by navigating these free pages or you can search in the search bar so for example I want to search for Apple I just need to type Apple and we'll have a ton of um, Apple articles where you can subscribe to after that go back to your home page it will pop up the articles about Apple and one thing that's good about um, Mixed tab is when you click onto an article, uh, you have some simple and relevant information about the topic. But if you want more information, you can view original and it goes to the actual website that provides the information. Here's the original page, and you can click back to Mixed tab to go back to the simple version. If you go back to your home page and if you want to remove a tab, you can just click on edit tabs and it's like iOS and you can just like X the tabs that you don't want. After that you can just click done editing and that's it. Now in the settings there is themes where um, they're really nice for your background and in preferences all it has is that you can choose whether you can view the original links in mixed tab or in your web browser. So. I prefer Mixtab because opening your web browser makes it more cluttered. And in your account info, you can um, change your password and also your language. Mixtab is currently free in the Mac App Store. And go ahead and download it and see you guys next time.